Pakistan's National Assembly has elected a new speaker and is days away from choosing the country's next prime minister. The party of imprisoned former leader Imran Khan claims the results of the general election were rigged to favour Nawaz Sharif's PMLN party, which is set to come to power through a coalition. Hiram Mustafa has the details. Friday's session once again saw chaos, sloganeering and protests by opposition benches. For the second day in a row, jailed former Prime Minister Imran Khan's party lit protests inside Pakistan's parliament, alleging that the people's mandate had been stolen. The election for the post of Speaker and Deputy Speaker was conducted, with the outgoing Speaker repeatedly calling for order in the House. Despite that, the National Assembly now has a new Speaker. The candidate put up by the coalition between Nawaz Sharif's party and Bilawal Bhutto's party secured 199 votes. The candidate backed by Imran Khan's party got 91 votes. This sets the stage for a Sunday's election of a prime minister. The coalition has enough numbers to elect their candidate, Shabaz Sharif, but Imran Khan's party, PTI, has also nominated its own candidate. Shabaz Sharif was last the Prime Minister after Khan was ousted in 2022. Experts say he's experienced but not as popular as his brother Nawaz Sharif. The three times former Prime Minister returned to the country last year, ending his self-imposed exile but chose to stay away from the race for Premiership. Next week, Imran Khan's party has called for nationwide protests. It is demanding that the Election Commission probe poll rigging allegations. However, the Election Commission has denied those claims. The poll body has meanwhile announced the schedule of the presidential election, which will be held on 9th March. The coalition's candidate, Asaf Ali Zadari, is expected to win that race too. Meanwhile, 31 U.S. lawmakers have urged Joe Biden to call for a credible investigation before recognizing a new government in Pakistan. Experts argue that international criticism of Pakistan's election has raised concerns about the country's democratic system and is also a shot in the arm for Imran Khan's party. Hera Mustafa, CNA, Islamabad.